Kaylee and I just went to Sam's Club and picked up this Sea and Sky Premium Collection Crown Zenith box. We're gonna open it up. It comes with 14 packs of Crown Zenith and see how many rares can we get. So here we have it, our Sea and Sky Premium Collection box from Sam's Club. A very large box, hopefully it is still in stores in your area. Kind of destroy it there, that was pretty rough. Uh, but we got it out. That's the important part. Of course you do get these promo cards, including a Rayquaza Giant card. Oh, oh. Well, I dropped all the promo cards, but as you can see here, we have a holographic Rayquaza, Rayquaza V, holographic Kyogre, and Kyogre V. But what we all are looking forward to, the 14 packs of Crown Zenith. Hopefully we can get a lot of gallery cards in this and hopefully cards that we don't already have. So here we go, two huge stacks of seven packs each. All right, let's get opening. Without further ado, we have a lot of packs to get through. So first pack of Crown Zenith here. All right, first pack, here we go. First pack. Here we go. Grass Energy in the front, followed by Graveler, Pokemon Catcher, Salazzle, Ponyard, Seal, Rock Ruff Howling at the Moon, Aaron playing with some steel, Ryulu, Shinx Reverse, and for the car on the back, oh, a regular rare Sizor. So, no luck from the first pack, no first pack magic. But that's okay, we have plenty more to go. All right, second pack of Crown Zenith here. The corner is a little bit messed up, so hopefully that does not translate to the cards that are in the pack. That'd be a little unfortunate if they are messed up in the corner there. Hopefully not, it doesn't look like it. All right, electric energy in the front, followed by an Ultra Ball, Salazzle, Dusclops, Tangela, Baltoy, Galarian Meowth, Whalmer, Shinx, Reverse Energy, and for the crown on the back, we have a Charizard V. So that didn't take too long to get a rare pool. An awesome Charizard V there. Pretty cool card to see out of just the second pack already. Hopefully this is a sign of things to come. Third pack now of Crown Zenith, opening up a lot of Pokemon cards. So hoping for a lot of rares. All right, four to the front. Let's see if we can get another hit after that Charizard. Here we go with the fire energy in the front. Followed by Lexio, Electrite, Rescue Carrier, Scyther, Emolga, Young Goose, Cheruby, Execute, Volcarona Reverse. And for the card in the back, we have, oh, regular rare Snorlax, but it is made out of yarn, so that's pretty cool. All right, so a crochet Snorlax is cool and all, but not exactly what we were looking for. Let's see if maybe every other pack, maybe the every even number pack can have something good in it. All right, for the front and away we go. Let me know what were some of your favorite cards from Crown Zenith in the comment section down below. I'd love to hear it. Water Energy in the front, followed by a Dusclops, Matang, Energy Switch, Starly, Scyther, Pokeball, Young Goose, Cheruby, oh, Luminion V! There we go! <laughs> One of the cards that Kaylee was looking for in this set of Crown Zenith. We have finally pulled it, Luminion V. Look at how awesome that artwork is. From the Galarian Gallery, of course. We still don't know what the card in the back is, though. And the card in the back, oh, another Snorlax. But that's okay, we got the rare card that we were looking for. 
So 10 packs remaining. Seems like the even number packs so far have been the rare ones, but maybe we can turn that around here with pack number five. Who knows, maybe uh, more rares to come. And if you were able to get your hands on this from Sam's Club, let me know if you had it. Uh, good luck from this as well. Four from the back. Let's see if this luck can keep coming our way. Fighting Energy in the front, followed by Graveler, Pokemon Catcher, Salazzle, Ball Toy, Galarian Meowth, Whalmer, Shinx, Larvesta, Marie, I think we need that one for the all nine cards that make up a cute little artwork. I think we do need Marie. So awesome to get that one there from the Galarian Gallery. And for the card on the back, a hop holographic signed. Wow, he even he signed it for us. Not really, but sort of. But Marie, of course, being the highlight of that pack there, and we did break the trend a little bit with getting a card out of an uh, odd numbered pack. All right, nine packs to go. Already got some pretty cool pulls so far. Crown Zenith was a set that had some pretty decent luck to it, at least with getting Galarian Gallery cards. Hopefully the even luck does continue though, and we can keep getting good pulls. For the front, Dark Energy, Friends in Sinnoh, Crushing Hammer, Luxio, Shinx, Corefish, Ponyard, Seal, Rockruff, Apuchina. I think we might already have this one though, unfortunately. So perhaps that goes in the trade binder, trade for ones that we don't have out of the nine cards. And behind it is Bia with her holographic signature as well. All right, on to pack number eight. Will we get another Galarian Gallery card in this one? Let's find out. Here we go with the V-Star counter in the front, followed by Giraffe Rig, Pin Churchin, Pin Kirchin, Pin Kirchin, Pokemon Catcher, Rock Ruff, Purloin, Love Disc, Chat Out in the Rain, very sad, Yanma. Blossom Reverse, and for the card on the back, a regular rare Lycanroc. Not what we were looking for. All right, we are halfway through the opening. So far, some pretty good pulls. Let's hope for some more through the second half of our Crown Zenith box that we got from Sam's Club. And here we go. We got ourselves a Fighting Energy. Followed by Crushing Hammer, Gloom, Friends in Sinnoh, Purloin, Salandit, Bidoof, Coughing, Sunkern, Ponyard Reverse, and for the last card, we have a Zara Aura V. So, what do you know? We got ourselves another hit here with Zara Aura. Pretty cool artwork there with his slashing little claws. Electric claws. Slashing. Claws. Electric. Zero or a V. All right, six packs remaining past the halfway point. That's a good amount of rares, I would say. So, pretty happy with opening so far. Hopefully we can finish on a couple more. Turn it over. We have a steel energy in the front. Followed by a Great Ball, Gloom, Friends in Sinnoh, Cricket Tot walking across a log, across a path that we don't know how far down that falls, Ponyard, Yanma, Emolga, Love Disc, Executor Reverse, and for the card on the back is a regular rare Yan Mega. Not what we were looking for, but that's okay. We still have five packs remaining. Let's make it happen. Haven't pulled a Galarian Gallery card in a little while. 
we've seen a rare card here or there, a V card, or just a regular rare, but no Galarian Galleries in a little bit. Hopefully we can turn that around with this pack here. All right, once again, we have ourselves a V-Star counter in the front, followed by a Salazzle, Rescue Carrier, Lunatone, Aeron, Potion, Seal, Oddish, Larvesta, Seal Reverse, and for the card in the back, a Calyrex Holographic. So while it is kind of a hit, not what we want. We want either those V cards, V Star, or even Galarian Gallery. Four packs remain out of 14. We've gone through 10 packs, got ourselves a fair share of rare Pokemon cards. How many more can we get? Water Energy in the front, followed by Pokemon Catcher, Penurchin, Girafferig, Galarian Meowth, Baltoy, Tangela, Ponyard, Ponyard, Snowrunt, a Latias Galarian Gallery. What do you know? We managed to pull a Galarian Gallery card now. Ask and you shall receive, I guess. Pretty cool Latias. And the card behind it is a Zacian Holographic, but not the highlight because it is really this Latias card. All right, Kaylee already has that one in her collection. So hopefully something different here with this Crown Zenith pack. We only have three packs remaining. So there's only three more chances to get a card that we don't already have in the collection. Let's hope for something different. Four from the back, starting with Fire Energy, Laron, Rescue Carrier, Carnivine, Galarian Mr. Mine, Shinx, Cricketot, Ponyard, Yanma, a Glaceon V-Star. What do you know? Our first V-Star out of the 14 packs, and it's Glaceon. Really awesome artwork there. Cool to see, and behind it is, oh, Tangrowth. Not nearly as exciting as this Glaceon V-Star. All right, and so there were only two, two packs remaining in Crown Zenith. Of course, we're going back to these Sword and Shield era cards with the yellow borders. Let me know down in the comment section below. Do you like the yellow borders more or the gray borders that they use on the new Scarlet and Violet cards? Put them to the front, water energy, and away we go. So let's see if we can follow up that Glaceon V-Star with something cool. Salazzle, Rescue Carrier, Lunatone, Shinx, Cricketa, Ponyard, Yanma, Chatot. Oh, what in the world back to back? Glaceon V-Stars, what are the odds of that happening? Not only is it the only V-Star cards that we've pulled out of this opening, but back to back. That is crazy. And the card behind it is a Hatterene V. So what do you know? Something a little bit different there. I don't think we have this one in the collection. Crazy to have back to back Glaceon V-Stars. All right, last pack, here we go. Crown Zenith, the lights are dying on me here. We're running out of time. Gotta open it up before all the batteries die and we have to recharge everything. Last pack of Crown Zenith. Fingers crossed for some last pack magic. And hopefully it looks just as magical despite having one fewer light working right now. Four from the back. Here we 
go. Dark energy in the front, followed by Carnivine, Friends in Hisui, Shaman, Whalmer, Galarian Meowth, Baltoy, Tangela, Larvesta, a reverse steel energy, and for the last card in this Crown Zenith opening, we have. A Zacian V Star! What do you know? Some last pack magic with this Zacian here. Pretty awesome to see. So, wow, we finished it out there with a lot of V Star cards, two of which were identical. All right, so that's all we have for our Sam's Club Pokemon card box that we opened up with 14 packs and actually a decent amount of pulls out of that. We already know that Crown Zenith has some pretty good pull rates though, so cool to see all the Galarian Gallery and V-Star cards that we were able to pull. That's all we have in this video. I'll catch you in the next one.